joined by Dan Colco and Dan so nice to have Edwin Jackson back with the team and such a great teammate when he was here before gonna do that again but even more impressive was how well he was able to pitch in his return to, to the Nats. That's right, Byron. I mean, you talked to Nationals officials prior to yesterday's game, and they admitted that they truly didn't know what they were going to get out of Edwin Jackson. Listen, Edwin has a track record. He's had success at the big league level, but he's also bounced around a lot over the course of his career, and especially over the last few years since he's left the Nationals back when he was with this club in 2012 with a lot of different organizations up and down from AAA to the big leagues. And so he comes up for a spot start, and the Nationals weren't sure what they were going to get out of the 33-year-old right-hander. What they got was seven tremendous innings allowed just two runs, the two solo home runs. Dusty Baker saying after the game it was really only one mistake, the hanging breaking ball late in the game, I believe it was to Maldonado. Uh, but other than that, Edwin Jackson pitched his butt off and it really gave this Nationals club exactly what they needed, turning the ball over to those two new relievers as you talked about. And after the game, Edwin Jackson with his new teammates all around him talked about his outing, his first one back with this Nationals ball club. Just attacking the zone. Um, I mean, just attacking the strike zone, making the hitters put the ball in play, and letting the defense, you know, work behind me. Um, I mean, my biggest thing has always been walks, 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 walks behind in a counter, walks, and then you get a big hit. And um, just been trying to focus on coming out and, and putting an attack on hitters and making put the ball in play. At this point in your career, to get this kind of opportunity, do you do you appreciate these more to to be sent out there on a, on a team like this to be able to do that? Um, definitely. Um, I mean. I'm, I'm out here to cherish every moment. Um, like I say, I've been through my ups, I've been through my downs, I've been in AAA, I've had people asking me why am I still here, why am I still playing, I've made some money in the game, why don't I just go home and enjoy the family, but um, I still feel like I have something in the tank and I, I still feel like I don't have anything to prove anyone else, I still have something to prove to myself that I can go out and I can be effective and I can be efficient and I can help this team do something that they've already been you know, on the path to doing and it'll be fun to come in and help a team that I've been on before and had the chance to be in the playoffs with before to come in and do something special. Maybe the most important part or encouraging part of what Edwin Jackson did here last night outside of you know delivering seven strong innings was that he didn't walk a single batter and walks have been the maybe biggest issue for Edwin over the course of his career. He said that Daniel Murphy came up to the mound at some point early on in the game, told him to make the hitters beat him, to attack, and that's what Edwin did. He attacked these Angels hitters, no walks over seven strong innings. And talking to these Nationals players after the game earlier on today about Edwin, Bryce Harper said he's one of the best teammates he's ever had. Jason Worth said it was tremendous seeing what Edwin did last night. These guys that played with him back in 2012 love Edwin Jackson as a person, as a teammate. And then to see him go out and pitch as effective as he did. Really a huge boost for this club. The Nationals, again, they're, they're not maybe expecting massive things from Edwin Jackson over the course of the rest of the season, but Dusty Baker said last night he definitely did enough to earn another start with this Nationals club, and they'll go from there. And if Edwin can contribute and be a regular fifth starter for this club, all the better. We'll see what happens down the road, but for now, Byron, a tremendous story seeing Edwin Jackson back with a curly W on his chest and delivering in a big way here out in uh, California.